Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying two Ben & Jerry's ice creams that we haven't had before. Uh, this one says fan favorite. It is a uh, cannoli. And this is a new one, the Netflix, uh, Netflix and Chilled. These were $4.99 each at Meyer, And I know cannoli says fan favorite, but I've never had it. So we just, uh, we missed it when it came out the first time, I guess. Yeah, whenever that was. Yeah. And you know, sometimes, I'm not saying this one is, but sometimes they just come to the shops, the scoop shops, and you don't see them. So I I'm don't sure know. parts of the country. Right. So this is mascarpone ice cream with fudge covered pastry shell pieces and mascarpone swirls. Two thirds cup, 135 grams is 360 calories, or you can eat the entire container for 1,090 calories. So. Makes me cringe thinking of the number. Oh, the number. <laughs> <laughs> the whole total you just calories. You to enjoy it. Just, it looks like there are a lot of hunks it in does. here. A lot, right up, right up at the top. So there we go. Oh, it smells it. fantastic! It really does. It I like the ice cream. Those pieces that there are a lot of them, at least there were at the top, mm -hmm. they're crispy. They're crunchy. The ones I have are not crunchy. Oh, really? They're kind of smooshy. Hmm. Not soggy. I'm kind wondering. Of rubbery. I'm wondering if mine weren't crunchy because they were at the very top. Because I bet you if you got that one, no, that it would one be was. crunchy. That one was crunchy. So it just depends on what you what you get. Yeah. So some of them are crunchy, some of them are. It that is an incredibly um, oh, sweet ice cream. I like the crunchy bits better than I like the squishy ones. I do too. I just got one that was very very chewy. Yeah, yeah, it's very chewy. So it's I, I almost agree. Tough. That the the it's like sweet sweet cream. Mm -hmm. It's um. It's good. But I wish they were all crunchy. I do too. I wish, I, do, I agree yeah, with you. Yeah, because when you get a smushy or a chewy one, it's kind of like, eh, eh, this is all right. But some of the Ben and Jerry's have been like, ah, oh, this one's okay. You could pass on it, whatever. If you've never had that, like we haven't, I would. This would be one that I would get, even though some of those pieces are chewy. The ice cream itself. There you go. Yes, it's so creamy, and it just it. Uh, that uh, mascarpone gives it a different flavor. Mm -hmm. It's wonderful. It, is different. it really is wonderful. I mean, even the smell, it smells different. It's definitely worth trying. Mm -hmm. I just, like I said, I just wish they were all crunchy instead of getting an occasionally soft one. So this is the uh, Netflix and Chilled. And I'm really looking forward to this one because this one has peanut butter. So it mm -hmm. is peanut butter ice cream with sweet and salty pretzel swirls and fudge brownies. It is a uh, two thirds cup, 390 calories or 1,180 calories for the entire container. It says Netflix. There's something for everyone to watch on Netflix and flavors for everyone to enjoy from Ben and Jerry. So we've teamed up to bring you a chillaxing new creation that's certain to satisfy any sweet or salty snack craving. It's a flavorful world and everyone is invited to grab a spoon. So, did the cannoli say anything? Yeah, it says, as a limited batch that captured the rapture of the classic Sicilian dessert, our cannoli captivated fans like no other cannoli could. And now that it's a full-time flavor, you and your cannoli can recapture the rapture all over again. Recapture the rapture, I like that. So, uh, sorry, I didn't read that a while ago, but, um, okay. So I immediately see a big hunk of brownie in the yeah, top. Big, big hunks of stuff. And it is peanut butter ice cream. So it is a, a different color. Oh, wow. Ooh, wow. Yeah, we both said wow. Does that <laughs> Well. Like fireworks. <laughs> or when uh, Garfield, they turn, plug in the Christmas tree. Yeah. <laughs> the family does uh, Yeah, so there are big hunks of brownie in there. I 
I smell peanut butter. Mm -hmm. I love the peanut butter flavor by itself. The peanut butter is really good. The brownie is okay. Honestly, I, I, like the texture I would just rather have the peanut butter. I know, just give me the thing of the peanut butter. Because mm -hmm. the brownie kind of, kind of throws you off a little bit while you're eating it. And did you get any pretzel? Mm. It's supposed to have some a pretzel swirl. I think I just got some. Oh, because I would expect you to get some crispy pretzel. It's salty more than, more than anything. Try right there. I haven't eaten right there. Right here? Yeah. Or right there. Looks like pretzel down right there too. I got salty. When I got the pretzel, yeah, try right in there, that area right there. When I got the pretzel piece, it was like saltiness. Cause I got it from over on this side. It's gritty. Mm -hmm. It's like a, um, it's not like your typical pretzel. It's like they've, um, they ground up though. Yes, it's like they ground up the pretzel. So it's really fine, gritty, but it's you salty. do get the salt. Yes, mm -hmm. you get the salt a lot. I like the pretzel. Mm -hmm. and I like the peanut butter. Don't necessarily love the brownie i mean i can get used to it but i think the brownie it's because it's so chewy it, it's and it's there's a lot of big hunks of it so in like big hunks of ribbons of it mm -hmm. so you get that and you're like all the, the ice cream's melted away and then you're left with this kind Hunk of, of brownie hunky piece of brownie. of course some people would love that and just you know exactly. so for me um i would like it better if it was just the peanut butter yeah. ice cream the peanut butter and even they could even do the peanut butter ice cream and the pretzels I, I I really um, don't care for the the uh, brownie at all. Yeah, I just don't like the texture. For me, how if somebody bought this for me, I would pick it all out. I would pick all the brownie <laughs> out, and I wouldn't even eat it. That's just, that's how much I don't like the. I don't. I got a hunk of it by itself, mm -hmm. and I just don't like the flavor of it. Yeah. So for me, I would pick out the brownie completely, and. Um, and eat all the peanut butter because I genuinely love the peanut butter. Um, and the cannoli, the cannoli is delicious. Cannoli's good. I like the peanut butter one better. I do the too. Netflix one. Even though I wouldn't eat any of the brownie, I, I still I love the peanut butter so much. Yeah, it's a really good peanut butter. Flavor. That that would be my choice out of the two. Mm -hmm. But they're both so yeah, good. They're both really good. Very though. very good. Um, so if you see either one of them, I would totally give them a try. I think they, I think they did a good job. And a lot of you, like Kevin said, you love the brownie in these anyway. So you're really gonna love the brownie uh, because they give you so much. That's that's one thing I can say about both of these is, in the past there have been times where we have been disappointed in the pints because we haven't gotten as many mixins as we felt we deserved. And for the so price. for the price. So these, I think they did a really good job they with did. the amount of mixes. They they're they're yeah. full. So I will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.